Gaston! Gaston de Franquin. Viva la revolution. These are times of change. Indeed, it does not matter what you try to do. You try to go about normally, and then the doors come off the walls. Ink comes out of pens. You may think that's how pens work, but it's all him. Gaston is behind it all. Gaston has a weird obsession with clocks. Gaston has a very dumb face. Every day I toil and slave away under the will of Gaston, running in circles day in and day out, over and over again, every day. It's all impossible. I am at my fucking limit. Hey, 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 LeBrock. Come here, yo, come here. Hey, come check this out. It's my new invention. I got the idea watching some funny show. I see. It's like an umbrella, but it's not. Umbrellas went open and closed. Gaston solution. It's a little motor that opens and closes it with the push of a button. Open. Click. Whoa. Closed. Click. Open. Ah. One, one sec. <laughs> it doesn't even work! <laughs> Malfe? Uh, I see. I see. It's brilliant. Ha 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 ha. What? It's Malfe? time to go. This is how you spend your work hours? Acting stupid and making worthless electronic toys? I don't even know how you have a job. When you spend all your time goofing around, calling us all over for things that don't even fucking work, oh my fucking god! Oh yeah, just don't understand the technological revolution. Does anyone appreciate it? Oh, they just say it doesn't work. Oh, my fuck! <laughs> Wait, no! Yo, come back! You don't have to be afraid! It's just an umbrella! Guess on, what have you done to the- Oh yeah, I just tweaked some things. It's gonna be revolutionary. You'll see it's all the rage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I'm not finished. Still got a couple bugs. Mm -hmm. Oh, what a pretty afternoon. Peaceful. Oi, Gaston! What's that? Are you smuggling something secret in that briefcase? Oh, Jules, a good eye. In fact, I do have something in here. Let me just get it open. Now, someone was throwing this away. It's just an old telephone, but the cord broke, so it can't make calls anymore. Can you believe that? So sad for all those telephones. Every day they're just vibing until the cord breaks and they get kicked out. That's why I'm gonna fix it and turn it into something else. A light. Ooh, a shower. Or a boat. Oh, nice. What about a scale? Oh, yes. No, I have a great idea. Okay, so first off, we got this, this, and that, some of this, some of that. Okay. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah, so there'll be no doubt you're the best pranker at Dupree. Well, good to see you, Jules. I'll tell you how it goes. Hell yeah, bro. Get that bread. <laughs> Perfect. One tug on this one, he answers the phone, and Prunel's mind will be blown. <laughs> Oh yes, it's happening! <laughs> Hello? <laughs> <laughs> what a surprise! Who would have seen that coming? Just kidding, I put these all up on your phone! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, man, I'm sorry, I won't ever do it again! Yes, again. <laughs> again. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Pruno, where did your glasses go? You know they keep you calm. <laughs> Uh, Mr. The Master Maker is here. I don't know what to do. Fucking uh, the contracts. You, you gotta keep him away. That the, the brute and the guy. You gotta chill, Prunel. Chill. It's fucking Gaston. I want you to find him, gag him, bind him, and then throw him in a cupboard. Okay, we won't do that, but I promise he won't get in. Uh. What chair? Fucking hell. Why is he in here, huh? Just a second. Hm. You'll see. This is a very delicate model. It's revolutionary. It's an astronomical clock. 
I can't believe it. Another space age beatnik hippie. Oh, this isn't just any clock. It's a space clock. You know, like a cuckoo clock, but cooler because it's in Nigga, space. Get the fuck out. This is no time for your shenanigans. Oh no, just a sec, just a sec. See, it's an exact miniature of the Apollo. And if I could get to the Apollo, I'd rip off their helmets for- You hear that? It's time. See, look at the little astronaut. He's cute, right? <laughs> oh, 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 he's so tiny. He's just a little guy. I love him. He's- Wait, I can see it now. We'll make many, many, many of them. Just a lot and make so much money. Only the name is good enough. How about, uh, the, the, the cosmic cuckoo? It's a cuckoo clock in the cosmos. Oh, yes, uh, the age, uh, the age of the space race, too. Electric Boogaloo! That is excellent! But, uh, Mr. and Mr. McGill, the, the contracts. Oh, yeah, give me those. Voila! We'll just change the name and get the idea and start selling those cuckoo clocks. I just need your name. Uh, Gaston. Mm -hmm. Gaston Legaff. Mr. Legaff, I'm so glad there's ink coming out of this pen. I know you're behind it. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I do that. Signé Franquin, le dessinateur qui remet les pendules à l'heure.